As we wrap up our preview of the 2013 Fordham University football squad, we finish with a look at the special teams unit, a group that is one of the youngest in the country. The Rams have a big hole to fill with the graduation of All-American place kicker Patrick Murray, but appear to have the right mix of players to maintain a solid kicking game. Leading the list of returnees is the lone upperclassman, junior Michael Morando, who served as Murray's place kicking backup in 2012. He appeared in nine games as a freshman for the Rams, connecting on seven of 15 field goals with a long of 41 yards in all 15 of his extra point attempts. Three newcomers strengthening the Rams' kicking game, Michael Chachi, Joseph Pavlik, and Mackey Red. Pavlik attended Mount Carmel High School in Chicago, Illinois, where he was named first team All-Catholic League and was an All-State and All-Academic All-State pick. Red, who graduated from Monte Vista High School in Danville, California, was a three-sport athlete in high school. He was named East Bay Athlete of the Year in 2012 and to the NorCal All-Star Bowl. Chochi, a graduate of Pope John Paul the High School in Boca Raton, Florida, was selected to play in the Florida vs. Georgia All-Star Game and was a two-time first-team all-county selection with the soccer team. But no matter who is kicking the ball for the Rams, he can't do his job without the services of a good long snapper, and Fordham has one of the best in senior Joseph Sullivan. Sullivan has appeared in all 33 games at long snapper since arriving at Rose Hill. Senior Vincent Antonazzi will serve as the backup long snapper and also as the backup holder on special teams. All right, I guess, Joe, first of all, explain to us how you got involved in long snapping. Obviously, it's not the position most kids think about when they want to play football. Yeah, uh, you know, I just, one day at my high school practice, my coach just was up behind us on the field, and uh, it was the day we were doing the punts and all the other special teams, and he came up behind us and said, who could long snap? I just turned to one of my friends and was like, yeah, I, I can long snap. I'm like, no problem, I got it. And the coach came up behind me. He's like, Sullivan, you can long snap? I was like, not really, coach. I was just kidding. And then he... Uh, tossed me over there, told me I had to do it. First couple were horrible, but then uh, I got into it, so. Now, did, did you go to any kind of special training camps or anything like that? Or no, you just... I, I went to a couple camps just to get ranked in, in high school. But then uh, after that, just snapped on my own and didn't really take any lessons from anybody. Now, obviously, it's one of those positions on the football team where nobody notices you. I mean, how, how do you feel about being kind of the unknown man? Obviously, unless you screw up, yeah. Yeah, that's when everybody notices you. Yeah, hopefully, I go unnoticed for the rest of my time here, I guess, and then I would have had a pretty good career. But I, I take a lot of pride in what happens on the punt teams and the, and the field goal teams and everything. So as long as they're doing good, I feel like I've, uh, I've accomplished something. Now, is, is there a difference between long snapping for uh, a place kicker as opposed to a punter? I, they're a little different. Obviously, one's a, a little shorter, and you got to snap it a little lower. But other than that, it's the same general mechanics. So, and uh, you've played in every game since you've been here at Fordham, kind of the Cal Ripken yeah. of Fordham football. Um, you looking forward to making it through the 12 games this year? I, I really hope. I just, you know, nothing happens, and uh, I just keep on playing, don't get hurt, and then end up with a pretty good 45 game streak. Hopefully, it uh, gets in the record books a little bit. So, All right. thanks, Jeff. All right, thanks. All right, Mike. Um, obviously, you got some big shoes to fill this year. I mean. We're not going to have another Pat Murray. I mean, how, how do, philosophically, how do you go into the season thinking? Uh, philosophically, you know, just uh, I want to perform to the best of my ability. You know, taking in all the information that the coaches get, you know, put into myself. Uh, and when when they, they see me kick the ball, just uh, they have their pointers from what they learned from Patrick. And, uh, and Patrick himself, too, has texted me throughout the year. And uh, even before, you know, if I have a bad day, I'll help, you know, hit up on Facebook and, uh, you know, see how he's doing. And more importantly, you know, to get the, uh, the information I need to really get back on track. Now, obviously, having practiced with Patrick and working out with him, I mean, how valuable is that to you to, to kind of, you know, be in his shadow the last year or two? Working with Patrick Murray was extremely valuable. He, uh, I mean, you've seen him kick the ball. He can drill it. I mean, in some practices, 65 yards field goal, which is, uh, you know, unhuman-like, if you may. <laughs> but uh, like I said, just uh, I have his number, just uh, like maybe if I have a bad day, which, uh, thank gosh, uh, over the past few weeks I have not. So mm -hmm. the thing is, if I give him a text message, it's not for a good thing. Just... Uh, <laughs> Other than saying hello, if right. I'm texting him, it's uh, really not the best thing for me. Uh, I mean, he's listen. He'll be, he's always around. Just uh, that's the kind of guy he is, a Fordham guy. So uh, most importantly, just uh, he gives in all the information he could, and the best thing he says to me is uh, just go out there and do your best. Now, obviously, you know you kicked some as a freshman, didn't kick at all last year, but the uh, the rest of the kickers on this roster are all freshmen. I mean, how does that as a junior? 
how do you, uh, you know, try to get your experience across to the freshmen? As a junior, it's definitely an opportunity to step up you know, for myself and definitely to, uh, to, to push what I have out towards the freshmen to, to say, you know, well, listen, you guys have it physically, but mentally, you know, you guys are coming from high school. This is a totally different ball game. You know, the, the stadium might be louder than uh, your high school, uh, the atmosphere was. So essentially, just uh, like the little things, like Coach Moore said, attention to detail and the small things that really matter. So I uh, really just break it down from there and uh, move on. And, you know, the, both kickers uh, that are freshmen uh, have a great opportunity to step up and become really, really, uh, you know, asset for this team. Thanks, Mike. Thanks, Joe.